Both of Frank Caputo's parents were born in southern Italy and instilled a love for that lusty cuisine and great wine in their son. After an associate degree at the CIA, he worked in five restaurants in five years. Not unusual for a young chef. Here is bouchy of shrimp and crawfish. The bouchy will be fashioned out of discs cut from a sheet of puff pastry. The bouchy is lightly egg washed and will be refrigerated for 15 minutes before baking. The pastry is baked with a homemade rack arrangement. This rack here helps it raise evenly. Bake at 450 degrees for 8 to 10 minutes. And when we bake it. The dish includes poached white asparagus and morel mushrooms. Morels, you need to trim the stem. Um, the, these morels are actually the very, very first of the season. They're uh, from uh, California. And um, they don't have that quite woodsy. Um, hugely morel flavor that they would have um, as spring goes on. Um, so they're, they're a good quality, but once again, they're the first of the season. We're just going to wash them twice to remove any sand, dirt, and uh, there aren't any, um, or we're hoping that there aren't any little critters in there just yet. We're just going to lightly poach the uh, asparagus, three to four minutes. We're poaching this in the, um, in a fish stock uh, flavored with the, the shells from the crayfish, crayfish thyme, and with the addition of, from the poaching of the asparagus and the poaching of the morels, we're going to introduce all these flavors right into the ditch, um, and pulling them all together. Once your asparagus are done, you remove them. You add a slight touch of the wine that you're going to feature in the dish. Allow the liquid to come back to a boil. And then poach your morels. They take approximately around the same time as the asparagus do to cook. The chef now prepares the seafood. Shallots are softened in butter. Our shrimp. Our shrimp takes slightly longer to cook. So we start them before the crayfish.
Had our crayfish. We're going to deglaze the pan with a liquid called verju, which means a green grape juice, Just to give it a little bit of acid. Let that reduce slightly. Once our seafood is fully cooked, we'll remove it. Add our Montreché. Let it reduce slightly. And add some of our poaching liquid that we poached the morels and the asparagus in. Let this further reduce. Meanwhile, the top of the bottom layer is removed from the finished bushi. Once our sauce is ready, we add our seafood, our morels, and asparagus, just to warm them through. Season with a little salt and white pepper. And fill the boucher. The sauce is finished. Add our cream. Let it reduce slightly. Sherbel completes presentation. Thank you.